We know summer's here because it's now game day for the Fargo Moorhead Redhawks. The Hawks getting a chance to compete for the first time this season in their first of two exhibition games. Fargo Moorhead with an opportunity to get a taste of live action before the regular season begins on Friday night. Now these live reps would be valuable in any preseason period, but it's especially crucial crucial for this Red Hawks roster. They have some brand new players in to replace some of their top batters this season, including all but one member of their starting infield from last year. For some members of this team, tonight's exhibition game will be their first ever taste of American Association play. I asked the group how important these preseason games are for their development. They're massive, especially for hitters, because at this stage, pitchers have the advantage just being fresh and hot. So for us, just getting our timing and getting comfortable being in the box is huge. And once we get caught up, we'll be going. <laughs> in the words of uh, you know Doug Simonick back in the day, it's really important to, at some point to play against the other colored uniform. And when you put uniform on and then you play against another team, that's kind of the biggest step on actually becoming a team. Wins and losses aside, it's like when you're competing as a team, that's where it all starts. You heard Chris Coast mention it a little bit yesterday. This certainly has become a budding rivalry with their opponents this uh, tonight. Last season, these two teams went to battle 15 times. Ten of those matchups were won by Sioux City. The Western Division rivals get reacquainted with each other tonight at 10 at 7 at Newman Outdoor Field. The Fargo Force picked another local talent in Phase 2 of the USHL draft this afternoon, and this draft pick may have a familiar last name. The Force selecting Moorhead Junior Brooks Cullen with the 400 or 242nd pick of Phase 2. I don't know what's going on right now. Brooks was the team captain for the Spuds last season and finished that year with 21 points, including 15 goals. He's the son of Spud legend Matt Cullen. So that's two Moorhead Spuds picked in the last couple days as part of the USHL draft for, uh, for the Fargo Force. Zach Zimmerman yesterday and now Brooks Cullen here today. Okay, but how conditioned are we to say tonight at 10? I know, I know. It's, it's like, like <laughs> PTSD. Into my yeah. brain. Right. I'm never going to not say it.